Sam, I'm such a dum dum. I forgot to go grab the girls when I was supposed to. I just got so busy and tied up. They're gonna be so angry at me. Good morning, beautiful people. What is happening? It is a gorgeous day in Vancouver today, and it's Friday. TGIF, thank God it's Friday. We're looking forward to this. Um, it's gonna be a good day today. I think after work, we've got some birthday party to go to. I'm pretty sure uh, one of my friends' uh, daughters is having their birthday. I can't remember where exactly. Wifey knows. But uh, it's, it's, a, you know, it's gonna be a busy day just because I had that project this week. So there's a lot of um, sort of support we gotta do afterwards. So I'm not gonna be able to go out during the day to do any errands, I don't think. Um, I'm hoping I can, there's some stuff I need to do. But we'll play by ear. What a busy Friday, fam. Um, it's ridiculously busy. It's like almost three o'clock. I actually gotta head out in half an hour to go see a buddy of mine. Um, my neck's in pain today. It's supposed to feel better, they say, the next day, but Muscle pain right on this side hurts. Just warming up my jaw. Warming up jaw means jaw talk, guys. Peeps, I'm gonna keep this short and sweet to the point. Um, just because it's something that I do and it's the way I do things and it may or may not work for you. Anyways, in yesterday's vlog, you can check it out right over here. Um, I talked about how I am able to balance my life and work and my family time. And one of the things that I did was I basically told my family that I'm not going to be around, uh, you know, for a little while so I can get everything set in motion. And when I'm done, you know, I'm going to be around whenever you need me at any time of the day. And that's in the position where I am now. Right now, quite a few people, not on Facebook, well, maybe on the Facebook comments, I didn't really read them yet, but um, personally messaged me and saying, well, you shouldn't neglect your family, you shouldn't neglect, you know, this, you spend time with your family. Look guys, um, this is again how I do things. I did not neglect my family. In fact, if you are in a position where you're not able to provide the best for your family, that is neglect. I chose to separate myself, do whatever I can to make it possible to provide the best for my girls, right? Now, because I was doing that, I wasn't able to spend as much time as I like to or be at some of these events because I was working for them. That is not neglect, that is looking out for the future. For those of you that had an issue with what I was doing, I am now in a position where I never need to do that again. So it was a short term pain for what is now a long term gain. You understand what I'm saying? I mean, you, you're quick to criticize me about how I handled my family situation, but you know, or that I was neglecting them or etc. That's clearly not the case. I was actually looking out for them and I did something about it. See, it's easy to say that, oh, you, you know, you, ne you neglected your family, didn't spend any time with them and blah, 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 blah. If I was continuously doing that, 100% I agree with you. But I took a short period of time where I was able to bust my ass, work hard, work smart, build something for them. And now I can do whatever I want, whenever I want. That's not neglect. And if you think that's neglect, I'm sorry, but your thinking is whack. Because I did the opposite. I went out and I fought for my family and I did what I could. You understand what I'm saying? Again, I'm not hating on anybody. I appreciate the comments. I appreciate what you guys are saying, but I'm just different than some of you. I think differently than some of you. You know, that's, that's all it is. I took something that was dear to my heart and I did whatever I could to make it the best possible situation for my family. You guys have the same opportunity too and maybe you're doing it now but in a different way. So for me it came down to spend all the time in the world with my family, which I'm sure they appreciate, and be broke and live paycheck to paycheck? Or was it take a little time out, a couple of years, work hard, spend less time with my family, and put myself in a position now where I can spend time with my family anywhere around the world, wherever I want, whenever I want? It's a no-brainer for me. That's not neglect. That is looking out for my family's best interests. So fam, this may work for you. It may not work for you. I don't know. It worked for me. And this is something where I had my family's blessings for as well. So it's not like, you know, they were blindsided by this. At the end of the day, you got to do what you got to do. So go out and crush it. Ooh, nice day, guys. Now I'm going to head out. Go see my buddy. Uh, I think wifey's picking up the girls. I'm not too sure, but I'll find out when she calls me. But uh, first things first, I got to get this appointment out of the way. And I'm not sure what's happening after that, but um, I should get home so I can finish work off. Okay, I think this won't take too long. I'm guessing probably about 
an hour. Um, usually we just end up, you know, chatting and hanging out in his office when, you know, you got so much work to do. are all done. I'm gonna head home now back to work. Uh, I got a bunch of work I gotta do for my buddy here. That's all good. I also got a prep too for tomorrow. Remember I got that full shoot I think. We'll see how it goes. You guys have fun today? Yeah, I had so much fun. Mr. J gave me the bubble. Oh cool. What movie did you guys go see? We went to go watch Elvin and the Chipmunks The Road Chip and actually we didn't go to like regular I Cineplex. Hmm. We went to Hollywood Cinema and it is smaller but cheap theater, right? Eh? It's a cheaper one, but uh, like the screen quality is actually really good. And they're not late like Cineplex. Like the show, it was twelve. Starts right away. Yeah, it um, start. It started like. So there's no exact, ads. Yeah. Yeah. Um, there was and, ads, but like it and, started exactly and, at twelve thirty, no late. And I stole the bubbles. That's not good. Why did you? I steal? didn't. So we're here at uh, my buddy's daughter's birthday party. It's called Funky Monkey, and. Uh, Kids will be about an hour, they'll play around. I think there's games and like laser tag and stuff like that. I hurt my finger. What happened? I hurt my finger. Why? It's just bleeding. Uh oh, that's not good. You want to go inside or no? Yeah, of course I want to go inside. Uh -oh. Fam, all done. They had a blast today. Um, I turned the camera off inside just because, uh, you know, my family and friends want to spend some time with them. Plus, there's a lot of kids in there, and I don't want to get in trouble with the parents. So, you got to be discreet about these things. You know what I'm saying? As a vlogger, you got to respect everyone. So, now I'm heading home, spend Friday night with the family. It's Friday night, fam, chilling out. Um, we've got anti social technology over there on her laptop. Uh, Selena's messing around with mommy. It was a good day. Good day today. I'll probably have that photo shoot tomorrow, just waiting for. Uh, Deep to come over, he's gonna come over, we're gonna go through some photos and stuff And the plan is to go shoot tomorrow, so I'm gonna get prepared for that But I wanted to say if you're watching the vlogs for the very first time, you know, thank you very much, I really appreciate it If you want to see more vlogs like this, please click on the eye in the sky Please subscribe to the channel, that way stay up to date with the latest, greatest information Of course to my peeps, be you, stay optimistic Enjoy the rest of your night, here's a big high five from me to all of you Bye.